Number one, they go off topic. For some reason, basically every history teacher goes off topic at some point during each class. One minute they're talking about the American Revolution, and the next they're talking about they spit on an elderly man's car for some dumb reason you couldn't care less to remember. You know a class is useless when even the teacher gets bored and starts ranting about their personal life. Number two, dates. One of the worst things about history teachers is they love to make you memorize dates, which is absolutely pointless. I'm pretty sure that knowing that the Battle of Constantinople happened in 1422 will not help you in any way, shape, or form. But the way most history teachers structure their classes, if you don't memorize these useless bits of information, you'll probably fail your history exams. And at the end of the day, Day, whether you get an A or an F on your exams, you won't remember any of the class material a year after graduating high school. Number three, they're boring. The reason most history teachers are boring is because it's easier for teachers to be boring. All they have to do is lecture about the Treaty of Paris for an hour and then repeat the same lecture to the next period. Boring, but simple. Now imagine if history teachers actually put effort in making their classes fun while educational at the same time. They'd have to put effort creating code games, forming dozens of Jeopardy questions, dressing up as historical characters, scheduling field trips, or simply adding humor to their teaching style. So if a teacher expects you to put effort in their class, then it's only fair that you expect them to put effort in their teaching.